Hi everybody. I'm going to do a quick video today on OMC Cobra 5.8 on how to diagnose uh, first and foremost your coil. If you got a coil like this, uh, this is a typical uh, external type coil. Um, really easy to diagnose. So I'm going to show you real quick on how to do that. You notice I have the carburetor off at the moment. We're going to do a video on how to rebuild that. At the bottom of your coil you have a plus and a minus. It's kind of important for the wiring piece, not so much for the testing today. So first thing, all right, and you, you can move these around. It doesn't, the polarity isn't that big of a deal for this test here. All right, so plus and minus, this is on your low side. Currently sitting at 1.6. Um, for this reading on your coil, you need to be at anywhere between 1.4 to 1.8 ohms. Uh, you see it fluctuates a little bit as I apply more pressure on those bolt heads. But yeah, 1.5, 1.4, this is all fine. All right, so that's, you can see now, I'm at 20K, just like before. Apply plus to one side and go right through to the middle. And you're seeing 10.12. Um, for the 20K range, that's your secondary high side. You wanna be between anywhere from 8,000 or eight from what you're seeing here all the way up to 12, which would be 12,000 ohms. So as you can see here, we're between eight and uh, eight and 12, which would be eight and 12,000 ohms. So the coil's good. Um, just to flip back to 200, to show you again, plus and minus, 1.6. Remember, this range is supposed to be anywhere from uh, 1.4 to 1.8. If you're falling outside of that, Try picking up a new coil. It may be something simple like that. So that that's going to be how to um, quickly diagnose if you have a bad coil or not.